guys and welcome back to my channel this is the 3d print geek and if you're into 3d printing photography and drones start now by subscribing and hitting the bell so you won't miss anything we're talking filament today we're talking about the complete line of the silk pla from azure film i already had done a review in the past about the silk gold you find the link up here somewhere or down in the description I'm gonna show you today all the rest of the colors. They're beautiful and the vase mode is amazing with this kind of filaments. Let's roll the intro and let's talk about them. Before getting into the review, I would like to send a special thanks to Giuseppe, a really good friend of mine. He runs an Instagram page, it's called 3D Print All. You'll find all the links in the description. He talks about application of electronics to 3D prints. He reviews printers and filaments. And it's a great place to go and find ideas if you're out of them. Go check his page, all the links will be down in the description. So as usual, all the unboxing experience of Azure Film Filament are amazing all the filaments come in this beautiful white box inside there's a sealed vacuum sealed bag you will find filament is rolled in a very very great way and you will find a bag of silica gel for every every filament other film is a company based in Cezana in Slovenia very close to the Italian border so totally European uh, filament this silk filament I'm trying today I've been trying them all the colors for the last couple of weeks. I printed out vases, people were coming home, all relatives were coming home, I was stealing vases, so I was printing one after the other because they actually loved the colors. I'm gonna show you one by one all the colors that this silk line has because they're really impressive and the results are amazing, especially if you're printing tabletops or vase stuff. That's what I used it for. I'm not gonna print benches with the silk filament because it's useless when you buy a silk filament. You're buying it because you wanna do something beautiful, something ornamental, something that's gonna stay there and showcase and people are gonna see how beautiful that is. As mentioned in the intro, I already reviewed the silk gold filament. You'll find the links in the description. It was an amazing filament. Results were beautiful and uh, the images you sh you're seeing are about those print. Then I started printing out other stuff and let's start with the silk ocean blue is this color here. This is a small miniature of myself, a really good friend of mine, Vic De Carlo, created this low poly version of the 3D Print Geek. It's amazing. It's still an ongoing project. Vic, thanks a lot for this. And we continue to work on this, so I'm gonna present this very, very soon. There's already a new version. Then I printed out this vase in vase mode, 0.8, with extrusion. This blue ocean silk is amazing. Even touching it, it's so smooth. It doesn't even look like PLA when it's, when it's finished. And uh, one of the characteristic of this, uh, of all the silk PLA from Azure Film is the quality of reflecting light it's really really shiny and when you put there it doesn't even look like plastic it looks like um, like something made of stone and then painted with uh, some kind of uh, of glossy color but no it's PLA and it looks amazing one of the most beautiful and my favorite one is the flame orange silk I've nearly finished it I don't know if you can see it over there spool is nearly over and probably you already seen this on another video or short couple of days ago but the silk orange filament it's it, it resembles a little bit the gold but you can see all the shades of the orange and I really, really love this. I printed out a huge vase, 35 centimeters, for a really good friend of mine. She loved that. She asked me, please, please, can you, can you do one this size for me? It came out amazingly. It's like, it was really, really beautiful. This flame orange is, as I told you, 
my favorite and not because of the color it because of the way it reflects light you can see it very very orangey in the morning but when you're in golden hour this becomes gold and it's a characteristic in a PLA that uh, you need to research and I really really like it and uh, this was print again 0.8 extrusion in vase mode this took roughly I think six hours and the result is amazing I mean you put it there this is decorating the house I went and got all of them out from the lounge room from the kitchen where all these were already sitting because I had to do this video so house looks empty and when you put stuff like that it really decorates the house and people go that's something weird I've never seen something like that so these very very bright color are add something to your house and they add them in a way that nothing else does another interesting filament is the silk silver this is the same vase a bit smaller same with extrusion so it's very nice and sturdy this silver i must say it's not very bright it gives the silvery effect but it keeps it uh, it keeps it darker than a regular silver it doesn't shine but at the same time it keeps that glow of silver in it especially when light jumps on it and you can see that with this with this bowl here probably you see the light coming in from the window reflecting on it and the effect and there's something in my kid left something in and the effect you see is quite amazing so the silver is less bright than other silver PLA that I've tested but at the same time it keeps this really really nice characteristic when, when you see it's silvery when light hits on it last but not least is the dark copper I was expecting for something darker but this color turned out to be one of the favorite of my wife and my mother-in-law and all the relatives this is an ancient silk copper and I'm gonna show you when I saw it at the beginning I wasn't liking it that much because it kept this purpley antique color and glow but then when my wife told me print a couple of them let's put it on our old furniture we have some pieces of some antique pieces these fit on the antiques in a way that nothing else up to now does so or did and you can see it's dark copper it has this like little point of purple in it all the links to this vase uh, will be in the description for your reference and part of the fact it prints amazingly all these silk PLA printed had a suggested printer from 220 to 240 only this one had print uh, print temperature set to 220 I used 225 because I was printing in vase mode I like to bump the temperature a little bit higher when you're printing in vase mode for a better layer adhesion and results are these so it looks really really good what else can I say about this silk filament they're beautiful I mean all the spools are nearly gone because people are asking me please print me that please print me that and for the purpose of testing it I'm printing them all out so silk filament beautiful if you need to do something that needs to be showcased some beautiful vase I printed out this like as I told you 38 centimeter vase with the Sidewinder X1 it printed out beautifully that was all for today guys I really hope you enjoyed the video don't forget that if you want to buy Azure film filaments you'll find the links in the description if you use the code Alessandro10 on your checkout you will have an extra 10% discount smash the like button guys if you like the video subscribe if you're not yet subscribed and I'll see you very soon